Hello Sagittarius. So this is your mid-month reading. I'm going to start with general messages. Okay. Universe, give me a three card spread of messages. So you have four Sagittarius. Some of us are dealing with a Gemini, meaning a new Gemini. Grief, envy, and doubt. Gemini energy is happiness. Okay. So if there's been a lot of things that have been happening back to back, especially when it comes to change, emotional things, what the universe wants you to do is just look at things half full instead of half empty, which sometimes can be hard to do so, but do so because things are always evolving. Things are always changing. Emotion, just energy moving, moving. Okay. So don't get too caught up with anything that is appearing to be negative okay and also let's just say when it comes to emotions um when it comes to emotions i'm sorry for that <laughs> that was a call so when it comes to emotions make sure that you are checking yourself too you know checking yourself and say you know why am i feeling this way checking yourself is like is this really me because sometimes people can be sending energy to you and if you're an empath you know you can sense that and that and if you do sense that you just need to do some orc field protection you need to do a spiritual bath. You need to pay, pay attention to what you're listening to, what you're watching, what you actually focusing on as well, okay? Knowing that you are the most powerful, powerful person in your life. Nobody is more powerful than you in your life, okay? Um, but yeah, the universe wants you to choose happiness, be in a Sagittarius optimistic energy, okay? So let's see what else I'm getting for you guys. Universe, give me a four card spread of messages you have for Sagittarius for the rest of this month. Very soon, trust. Let your friends help you and express your love and soulmate. Okay, so I feel like it's more so trusting in the process with the universe. Okay, start like continue to build the relationship that you have with God, the universe, and yourself. Okay, work on it more toy labor. Okay, so Universe, give me a four card spread of messages you have for Sagittarius for the rest of this month. Universe, give me message of concern. Universe, give me three more cards. House. Journey. Sudden wealth and family room. And privileged lady look at that so don't get too caught up with any type of you know whatever that might perceive as something negative because what it is it flipped to a positive with that house journey set and well family room and privileged lady so whatever that is perceiving as a negative situation or negative that just a test to see if you still have faith and the universe in yourself okay so don't get too caught up with this distraction this test Keep on focusing on what you should focus on and, and keep on being that positive energy, okay? Because you're going to get exactly what you want. Again, you are Sagittarius. Sagittarius is the most lucky sign. You guys are ruled by Jupiter. So don't get too caught up. So you see what else I'm getting for you guys. Look at the tarot. All right, universe, give me a five card spread. What messages do you have for Sagittarius for the rest of this month? Universe, four of pentacles. Universe, give me four more cards. Six of wands. Universe, give me three more cards. Six of Pentacles, Universe. Eight of Pentacles, Universe. Give me one more card. Hierophant. Justice in Reverse. Okay, so some of you guys, this could have been an investment or this could just be your own business. Probably you just started a business and you've been waiting for it to, you know, get to that next level of success. 
and I do see it's happening, okay? It just took some time with that Four of Pentacles, but I do see success here. Um, keep on working on it. Keep on being consistent. Keep being committed, okay? Um, let's see what else I'm getting. Universe, clarify the justice in reverse. Universe, clarify the justice in reverse. Universe, clarify the justice in reverse. Page, I said page. I don't know why I said page. I, I did. <laughs> okay. Page of Swords, Empress, and the Moon. Um, page of Swords, Empress, and the Moon. Let's see what this is about. Let's see if this is about love. Universe, clarify Page of Swords, Empress, and the Moon. The truth is coming out about somebody that you dated. I feel like you don't even think about them because here it's more focused on you. But here it could be like some truth came out about the someone that you dated. Probably they was married still. Probably they was in another relationship. This other person that they was with still watches you. Okay. Let's see what else I'm getting. Universe, clarify the four of pentacles. Hold on. My cat is doing something. <laughs> Universe, clarify four pentacles. Universe, clarify four pentacles. Judgment. Universe, clarify judgment. Universe, clarify judgment. Ten of cups, universe, cherry, universe, nine of pentacles, three of pentacles. Okay, here talking about love. So someone who was not being honest about what's going on in their love life. This person still want to be with you. Whoever they're connected with, they know about you and they still watch you. Like, this is someone who's not blaming their person. Like they're only blaming you. Okay. So you just got, you got two stalkers. Okay. You got someone that you used to, um, was a love interest or used to date in the relationship with, and then you got their people, their person watching. <laughs> Universe cup by the six of wands. Universe cup by six of wands. Six of swords. Yeah, you move on from this. You're not been thinking about this person. Yeah, look at that. So both of them need help. Universe clarify the six of pentacles in reverse. Universe clarify six of pentacles in reverse. So you got a lot of sixes. Three. <laughs> okay. So this could have been a karmic person for you. They're dealing with their karmic. You don't want no karmics around you. <laughs> okay. So with the six of pentacles in reverse, nine of cups, I feel like this is you filling your own cup. Okay. Universe clarify the nine of cups. Page of Wands in reverse, Two of Wands in reverse. Yeah, you know that you're better without this person. Universe, clarify the Eight of Pentacles. Universe, clarify the Eight of Pentacles. The Devil in reverse, Queen of Pentacles, Eight of Swords in reverse. Yeah, so you move on from this person completely. You've been focusing on you, on your business, on your goals, on your academics. Universe, clarify the Hierophant. Strength in reverse. Universe, clarify Strength in reverse. Seven of Swords in reverse and the Six of Cups in reverse. So this person still want to be with you, even though they, their person know about you. Like it's like a hot mess. But you don't have, you don't want to deal with this person. You know that this is someone who just a time waster. They don't even know what they want. They're a distraction, and you don't got time for that right now. You are focusing on your goals and accomplishing them. Okay, um, but yeah, you got two people that's keeping their eyes on you, watching you. You got your, this past love interest, and then you got their person. <laughs> okay. Um, the signs that might be significant, Earth or Scorpio. Okay. So Taurus for a Capricorn. Yeah, or Scorpio. That's the main energy here. Okay, so universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Sagittarius? Emotional loss, six of cups. So we've got five of cups, six of cups. So this person really miss you, but they're not doing what's necessary. They're still trying to be caught up with the person. Probably they did break up with them at the moment, but they probably still gonna have this karmic cycle with them where it's on and off, okay? But they do feel like you guys are meant to be, okay? Let's look at the intuition, which is the high priestess. Universe, clarify intuition. 
Universe card for intuition. Three of Cups. Even feeling this person want to reconnect with you a lot. Even feeling their energy a lot. But you know that this is someone who's still going to put you like in a third party. Like, mm -mm. so you're not going to entertain that. So let's like here. Okay, so universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Sagittarius? Okay, detective. Yeah, so this person that they're with still watches you. It keeps showing that they're all over. You're kind of sad and pathetic. <laughs> Mystic, scribe, and you've been feeling this too. Okay, Avenger. This person is sick, okay? Whoever they're with is demented, okay? I feel like this is someone who's weird. They watch you. Like, they might be like driving around your home weird probably trying to send you psychic attack so yeah going back to the general message where some of you guys have even been feeling emotional probably this is not all you this is probably like someone trying to send you a psychic attack um and it's probably whoever they're dealing with whoever they're whoever they was dealing with still dealing with at the time too sick person okay so if it resonates, just cleanse your aura, cleanse your energy, do a spiritual bath, you know, do a spiritual bath with salt, um, some Florida water, you know, cleanse your spades and your body with blue sage. That's my favorite one. Um, read Psalm 23 all the time. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah. And just forgive, like, you know, forgive this letter to that person, to to the other to your ex and also to yourself too just clear your energy space because yeah someone is trying to throw energy your way but you're the most powerful person so they can't do anything but i do see that and i do see that there it's weird okay so let's look at the angel answers universe give me a four card spread what messages do you have for sagittarius Look for a sign. Some of you guys are gonna have dreams about this person or whatever they're trying to do, okay? And then your future compromise with the next few months and yes. And ask help from others. Universe clarify, ask help from others with the next few weeks. Universe clarify with the next few weeks, not telling me. It's up to you, peace resolution. Yeah, so you guys are probably gonna talk to this past person, but it's best to just leave things closed, not to repeat it, because they're dealing with a karmic, and this karmic person is still trying to leech onto them. So it's just a hot mess. Universe clarify, yes. No. <laughs> Universe clarify, no. Take action, get more information. Yeah, and also if you've been wanting to do revenge, there's no need to because, you know, karma always come back around, okay? And karma take care of things better than, you know, being impatient. <laughs> so you see what I'm getting for you guys. Okay. So let's look here. Okay, universe, give me a two card spread. What messages do you have for Sagittarius? So there is friendship. Universe, give me one more card. And appreciation. Yeah, definitely hang out with great good friends for you that will live up the vibration. Okay. Don't get too caught up being in your head. Again, you're Sagittarius. Um, so especially if you have a sun or moon in Sag, you have to go out. That's just this is something that's natural. So travel, go out, do some short tri trips. Do something you gotta like don't be too caught up with your head you just gotta move okay so being with discomfort at times discomfort i encourage you to seek my soul essence which is clear pure and luminous then there is friendship i'm deeply grateful for the gift of friends my appreciation for them is endless and then appreciation Appre appreciating the good that is just my here and now expand my awareness to all that is good in the universe yep so choosing positivity and focusing on that too so that's the reading that I have for you, Sagittarius. Thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing. If this video resonates, you can definitely book a personal reading with me at queenfittytarot at gmail.com.